If you're using Ableton Live and you have a massive live set full of songs, I wanna show you one really simple tip and trick that's going to change your life. So I just wrapped up uh, two shows in Nashville, one on Sunday, one on Monday, both live TV taping, multi-artists, tons and tons of songs. This was the set I used for the Monday show, which is a Christmas special, multiple artists. Uh, it's massive, lots and lots of locators, a lot, a lot of songs. One of the most important things for me on stage was visibility. And what I mean by that was the ability to be in a song, uh, see my locators, and I'm looking at a, a pretty big screen here in the studio, but when I traveled, I had a 13 inch MacBook Pro, and, and let's just say my eyesight's not the best in the world, it's getting worse, I was in a dark stage, it was kind of hard to see and navigate. So I discovered this one little hack that I had never used before, that changed the whole experience. Real simple, we'll be done in 30 seconds. Go into Live's Preferences, Command, Comma. You wanna to go to the Look, Fill tab. Go down to Display Customization, and there's a lot you could do there, color intensity, but this one changed my life, Grid Line Intensity. I'm gonna click this and drag it up to 200%. It, it's maybe a little difficult to see on a screen, but I promise you, on that small 13-inch laptop that you have, try this and it's gonna change your life. And what it does is it takes the grid lines of Ableton Live set and makes it a little easier for you to see. Now, one of the things I do when I'm live on stage is I set my grid lines to be one bar. And let me see if I can try to show you this in real time. Again, it's hard to experience on a, a you know, just watching a YouTube video. But if I go back to the default, these kind of disappear, right? And we can make it, uh, you know, make them disappear even more, which is nice in some scenarios. But for this scenario, I can increase this and I clearly see uh, the, the division of measures and know exactly, uh, I, you know, what each measure is so I can follow along and count along and be a good playback tech. So if you want more tips and tricks like that, every single day I release a brand new video, you can hit subscribe, enable the bell icon to see that. And if you want a template that's gonna get you headed in this direction that's completely free for Ableton Live, then head to from studiostage.com slash template to download my free tracks template. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Happy holidays. We'll see you on the next one. Take care.